Do you feel that your 3D presentation skills before crushing deadlines is weighing you down? If this sounds like you, then continue watching. Hi, my name is Jason Chosselson and I'm a design architect. I've spent the last 18 years producing conceptual design and presentation for several major commercial firms globally. At the beginning of my career, I found that I was time bankrupt. I needed a straightforward approach to create 3D presentations that didn't rely on high-end rendering. I was looking for something that would help me produce compelling seductive 3D imagery in less time. I absolutely love the design process, but working through the nights at risk before deadlines, something that I needed to avoid. In direct response to this huge challenge, I found myself reinventing my workflow, discovering a light, somewhat different style, which has allowed me to produce extremely compelling perspectives in a fraction of the time. The artful render technique is exceptionally light on resources. The final imagery has an artistic touch that seems to be received by the clients in a pleasurable way. I have been privileged to share and empower hundreds of architects, building designers and students of architecture over the last year with this very same technique. You're doing all the modeling things and everything and then you have like a, oh my God, like a few hours to show the client what you did and you cannot show like a, just a 3D image from Archicad, you can, but okay. And just the process that you put us through, I thought was really awesome. What you're doing, helping everybody all over the world was really something, you know? I, I'm, I was just impressed with the whole experience. Using this hybrid method and pulling these two together. I mean, I've been looking at this for, for 25 years. And honestly, taking this course has been invaluable to me because it's probably saved me 25 years from having to figure it out on my own. Um, it's opened my eyes up. I, I've used SketchUp for quite some time and Photoshop, but he opens up the possibilities beyond what you, you may know, softening the renderings, communicating better. I found it just amazing. I mean, it really blew me away, learning some fairly accessible techniques, putting them together in a strategic way and coming up with imagery that I think really helps sell the ideas. The Artful Render technique um, gives me a whole new set of tools to approach that part of the process and really describe and sell the idea to the client. So there are four stages in the Artful Render workflow. Step one, two, three, and four. Let's take a deeper look. First stage is obviously jumping deeper into the process is in the design and modeling, the 3D design and modeling. A lot of people are using Revit, SketchUp, Vectorworks, AutoCAD, ArchiCAD, Rhino, Grasshopper. It doesn't matter what you're modeling in. You just need to know how to design and model in the software and you can engage in this process. So in step two, we're going to bring our model into SketchUp and we are going to add entourage. What is entourage? It's trees, it's people, it's cars, it's foliage, it's all those things that bring models to life. And we're going to add that in SketchUp. What we're also going to use SketchUp for is to create views, perspective views of our model. And SketchUp is extremely dynamic and flexible. And that is really the main purpose we are using SketchUp. And then we are going to export those views into Photoshop for post-production. So the third stage is the stacking effect in Photoshop. And we're going to bring all the images we produced in SketchUp into Photoshop for post-production. And we are going to use a method that is called the stacking effect. And we are going to assemble these images. We're going to soften these images and we're going to make a really powerful image perspective image for our presentation using the methods within that process finally we are going to do layout in photoshop we are going to take the images that we've already produced in photoshop and we are going to add them into a presentation sometimes we are going to be using the tabloid size presentation paper so the next step is i want to invite you to my free training that we have today as there's so much more that goes into it. In this training, we'll uncover some of the secrets associated with the artful render. The most significant asset an architect can have besides new clients is his design ability to communicate his ideas. There's so much more that goes into it. So go ahead, click the link and register for my free training.